guys welcome back if you're new here hi my name is Katie and if you are not hey girl how's it going oh so today don't mind me I'm just gonna use my sunglasses to put my hair back because I don't want to put it up because I'm trying to let it air dry I already did my brows I'm already primed we are gonna try out this new I think it's new. CoverGirl True Blend Matte Made. I've seen a lot of people putting reviews online about this. And we are going to try it out. I grabbed the shade L40, which is classic ivory, which is kind of like the shade that I kind of go to. Um. So, yeah. I filmed this the other day when I went to Family Dollar. But like I said, I already got my brows done. And I'm already primed. So we are just going to jump right in. You guys are going to have to not worry about the phone vibrating. It's just a crazy day. So it's got a pump applicator. I don't know if this is going to be... A, it doesn't say, does it? It doesn't say if it's supposed to be a full coverage or anything. So we are just going to find out. And I'm, lately I've been doing my foundation on a brush and then I'll like go over it with beauty sponge. And also I've usually been doing cream contour, but... I'm not going to today because what if I do not like this foundation and I end up taking it off. So I just did one pump. You can kind of see how much that is. We're just going to go right into it. I really hope I like this. Um, it looks like a pretty good match actually. Um, But yeah, I like I said, I found this when I was my family dollar the other day. I went there to get some Kleenexes. And I walk out of there with foundation, Kleenexes, and I don't even know what else. Okay, so this looks like it's a little bit more of like a lighter foundation. Like, maybe it's a buildable one. I'll do another pump. Um, yeah, so what have you guys been up to? I have been hanging out at home. My fiance was home for the weekend, and I worked... <laughs> A Friday night, Saturday night, and Sunday night. So that was fun. And like he left today, which is Wednesday today. I'm just gonna put a little bit on there for the forehead. Um, and he's gonna be back, I think, Friday. And I work Friday night. I close. The one bar I work at. And then I am going to. It's not working. I don't even have a ponytail. I don't think. So I'm going to just use our hands for this. Um, but then Saturday, I am going. To South Dakota to look at wedding dresses again and I've got my entire wedding party coming with well I shouldn't say my entire but I have my bridesmaids all coming so that'll be fun okay so what do we think of this foundation guys um, 
Don't make me. <laughs> I got leggings on. Um, looks nice. I kind of have been skipping out on the full full foundation lately. And I'm going to use my Koki Be Bright concealer. And I'm just going to put put this right in there cuz I I tell you guys. Um oh, and if you happen to be watching this, feel free to comment and like this video if you do like it or you know if you just want to help a girl out i'd be okay with that too <laughs> um and i'm just gonna take my beauty sponge now and we're just gonna do this sorry my phone's going crazy now of course you know why wouldn't it so Um, but yeah, if you guys missed my little, I think my, in my last video, maybe I talked about what was new in my life and I told you guys that I am a brand partner with Fit Team Global, which is an amazing, amazing company. And our goal or our focus is like health and wellness. And we have this is our main product is Fit Team Fit. It's just like a little crystal like packet, call it. And you just mix it in your water. I've already got mine mixed. Mm. It's so good. It tastes like it reminds me of like fruit punch and um, mixed berry flavors, like mixed together. I love it. And I'm down 10 pounds since September 21st. It is October 9th. The only reason I know the exact date is because tomorrow I have exactly a year until Abe and I get married. Isn't that crazy? So now I'm just going to go in with my Ciate de London Extraordinary Translucent Powder. And I'm just going to put a little bit on my sponge. And I am just going to blend that out under my eyeballs. And same thing on the other side. Um... I do put some on top of my eyes too, just because, um, but yeah, if you guys happen to want any information on my fit team stuff, comment down below and give me a way to contact you since, you know, I think YouTube got rid of messaging being able to message on YouTube so yeah um so yeah just comment down below on a way I can reach you whether it's an email Instagram Facebook phone number anything really and I would be happy to chit chat with you a little bit more on it I personally love it I love the simplicity like I've never had something so easy and um there's like a whole bunch of opportunity with it like you can uh just become a customer and just get it every month or you can get it become a partner and get your product for free 
every month, which is amazing. And it's worth it. Like, it's... Because, I mean, I've tried Isogenics, I've tried Shakeology, and I, I didn't like shakes that much. Like, I want to be able to eat my food. And with those, it's like, oh, you have to rep you replace one meal, one to two meals a day with food, a shake. Which I was okay with at the time. But, I mean, I'm a girl. I like my food, you know, and I'm just taking my May Maybelline Fit Me powder. I'm just going to put that all over the rest of the face to try to set it. Um, but yeah, Abe's cousin got me into Fit, and I'm so glad she did. Like, it not only helps with weight loss, but it also gives you energy. It controls, like, suppresses your appetite a little bit. And it boosts your mood. So, like, I have never been so, like, genuinely happy about, like, the little things. If that makes sense. Like, I love it. You know, when, I mean, it's awesome. Like, there's the business opportunity of it, and then there's just, like, the everyday opportunity of it. So, yeah, if you guys want more information on that, comment down below. Especially with the way that I can get a hold of you because come on it's fun it's nice it tastes delicious and you literally just do a glass of water put that in stir it up and then drink it 30 minutes before your next meal so I'm drinking this because then when I'm done with my makeup I am gonna go get some lunch I don't know what I'm gonna have for lunch yet I haven't decided yet I kind of want a salad, but we'll see. Or Subway. Subway's always good. Um, excuse me. Whew. So now I've kind of been doing like more of a natural eye look. Kind of like this foundation. It looks more natural. You know? It's just got like that clean face to it. So, what do we want to do? Um, I'm just gonna take my Urban Decay Naked Reloaded palette. This is one of my favorite ones. I love these shades. So, don't mind my messiness here. But I like to go in to Bucked right here. It's like a really pretty neutral brown. And it's so pigmented though. That's why I only take like a little bit. And then I like stamp it out. And then I buff it out. You can see that I need to pluck my eyebrows, but I've been too lazy for the last couple days. Oh, look how pretty that is. It just has a little definition to your eyes. And then same thing with the other side.
I do dip back into it a little bit just to kind of stamp it all over the lid. Like so. But then I just kind of go and buff it out right here. Yeah, and that's what we are left with. And then I go in and take this darker one here, Endgame. And I don't do very much at all. Like, and I like X tap off all the ex excess because this one's super pigmented so then I like stamp it on the very outer corner and then I just mark it up a little bit into the crease and on the outside corner of the lid there's a fly in here and it's bothering me. So then I just, just like that. And same thing with the other side. Sorry guys, my phone's going crazy over here. Oof. That one's much darker. Whoopsies. We'll just darken this side up a little bit. There we go. Much better. And then I just take my big fluffy brush that has foundation on it. And go like that and brush it all off. And then I take just like a flat fluffy brush kind of thing and I go in with this very end one blur and I just put it on, go like that, and then I just go like that. So essentially, I'm just lightening this part up. And blending it out for the most part. Okay, that fly is really going to bother me. I don't know if you guys can hear it. So then, I know I said I was going to go for more natural, but it's okay. It's okay. Guys, it's okay. Let's see. <laughs> I'm thinking. It's so good. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so now I'm going to take Angel Fire, which is like the champagne-y color. It's kind of got a pink glitter to it. And I just push it onto the eyelids. Because it just adds that little sparkle.
I love this one because of that pink sparkle that's in it. It's so pretty. And it just lightens it up a little bit. So now I'm just going to grab my eyeliner. I've got my Physicians Formula Eye Booster Waterproof Ultra Fine Liquid Eyeliner in the blackest black. Like, I love this packaging too. It's like, because it's waterproof. It's got little, like, specks that you can actually feel that look like water droplets. Excuse me. And I start in the corner and just go out. I don't know, you're just going to be like, obviously, like, that's common sense. But some people start on the outside. Because some people like to draw their wing first. I don't. Because I don't draw a wing. I use my stamp. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh, well. That's lazy. It might be lazy, but it saves me time. And I'm okay with that. Looks about even, for the most part. So then I take my vamp stamp. And it's literally just a stamp. It's so easy to do. You just like paint on your eyeliner. And then you just line it up to the angle you want it at. And push it in. And ta-da! That one's like way too, like that way. Oh well, it'll be fine. I don't have anybody to impress. I mean, I already got the man, so. I literally just got, how did I get eyeliner on my mouth? What the hell? That's interesting. My nose is running too. Like, honestly, how did I get eyeliner on my mouth? Well, we're just gonna... I'm actually gonna get rid of that in a minute. So, then what I do is I go... go back in and just kind of connect everything. Just like that. And then I like all these brushes in here that I, but you know, when I'm looking for a specific one, you know, God forbid you can find it. Well, I'll just go with this one because I'm sure the other one is somewhere around here. So then I just take like a flat kind of brush and I go into that dark color that I have on my eyes.
So essentially I'm like creating like a little bit of dimension. There we go. I'm going to buff that up. Don't worry. Wrong side. Then I will just take like a one thing I never do. That's gross. Don't do it. But I don't have... There we go. There we go. Nobody will even notice. See you. Ta -da. Okay, so I'm gonna do my blush real quick. I, I haven't been able to find a new blush, so I've just been using my Frat Boy by The Balm that came in this awesome palette thingy. Now, I like to do my blush first lately, and then I'll do my bronzer. And I'm able to kind of blend it in more. Then I will take this brush and go into my Huda Beauty. And I've been using the Santorini, which is like this light, icy white color. And I literally just like stamp it on. I've noticed that that gives you like the most payoff. But it also makes it so that you're able to tone it down if needed because it's not like crushed into your face. My disaster of a hair.
Okay, so I don't want to do my lips next, but let's see if I can find my it is, my matte lip liner from NYX in the shade Whipped Caviar. Super pretty, super super pretty. Love it. Um. my mirror that I've been using. So I'm just going to line my lips real quick. I need to sharpen this. It's such a pretty color. You get how pretty that is. And then I like to go in with my bat Maybelline Maybelline, right? Maybe. Yeah, Maybelline Baddest Beige. And I so pretty it's like the perfect pinky nude mm. I love it I love it so now let's do our mascara and I I'm gonna go in with my lash lift by Pixie by Petra this has kind of been my go-to mascara lately. Perfect on one eye. So I do that and then I let it dry down for like 30 seconds or so. Drink a little bit of fit. Fucking dog hair. Oh. For those of you that don't know. I have a German Shepherd. Love him my life. Love him to death. He's my favorite. He's my bug. He sheds everywhere. 
so then I go in with my Thrive Cosmetics Liquid Lash Extensions in the shade Brin, which is a rich black. And I do that on top of that mascara that we just did. Like, look at that. It's so pretty. Love it. And then I go in and I use my Glow Mist by Pixie. And then I take the flat end of my beauty sponge. I just press that into my face and there we're done so yeah that is my kind of like my everyday look it doesn't take me too long it doesn't take me as long when I am not recording it and my cute little flower um but I also wanted to try it out, this new foundation, and see what I thought of it. So, check out my Instagram. I think it's Katie underscore Rinky. My dog. He acts like he's so tough. He's like the biggest baby ever. I love him. Um, and like I said... If you guys want more information on my Fit Team Fit, comment down below where I can get a hold of you. And then I can give you all the information you need and let you know about like some of the deals we go, like the pricing wise and whatnot. Because I know a lot of people have asked me like, well, how much does it cost? And it's like, well, it truly depends on like what you want to do with it so yeah but this is the final look what do we think of it <laughs> I like it I like it I think it looks pretty you know I'll add some loose waves in my hair I don't know if you can't I don't know if you can tell, but like my hair is kind of wavy. So we'll see. We'll see. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.